Hi everybody, welcome to day 29 of ARD Countdown series for number upgraded 2025 examination. And let's have a look at the questions so we, dis we had yesterday in day 28. Question number 1 was the total water requirement of a crop includes. So basically throughout the life cycle of a crop, whatever at different stages it requires water, right? So what is the total requirement it includes of? So basically it is your, it includes whatever irrigation facility you are providing, what is the rainfall that is happening in that particular area how much moisture is present in the soil and also groundwater contribution means if in nearby places there are lay uh, there, uh, there is a pond or something like that uh, that is also uh, contributing to the total water requirement okay coming to question number two which irrigation method provides maximum water use efficiency under Indian condition so here the correct answer is drip irrigation because here directly the water is being uh, given uh, into the roots of the plant all right so it avoids uh, or it prevents a lot of uh, wastage of water which can happen due to evaporation due to uh, uh, due to the surface runoff or due to the deep percolation all right and especially at in, in, in Indian condition where temperature is quite high this actually suits the best third question is the irrigation requirement of a crop is defined as like how much water as an irrigation should be provided what is irrigation it is the artificial application of water one need to understand that uh, that mindlessly water is not given into the field in the form of of irrigation first it is properly check that how much rainfall uh, that particular area receives how much washed moisture is actually present at the current situation in that particular field then only accordingly irrigation facility is provided all right so what is irrigation requirement of a crop it can be defined as the depth of water required from irrigation considering other factors are also there rainfall and uh, other things that we have already discussed to meet the crop total water requirement after considering the contribution of rainfall and other like how much soil that uh, how much moisture that is already present in the soil etc coming to now question number one for today one horsepower is equivalent to approximately how much watts second the indigenous flow creates furrow of approximately how much depth and finally the implement used for breaking hard pan below normal flowing depth is comment down the right answers and we will discuss in the next class thank you